Y'all know when that shit on me, um, <laughs> I bop it, you know. And I know this is a, a situation. This is um something I know a lot of people in the world can relate to. That's why I truly believe I, I really understand it as I get older. You're not supposed to have sex into marriage. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like you're supposed to have kids when you're married. So I know a lot of people in my shoes. I'm not sneak dissing. I'm not bashing. I'm not talking about my child's mother in, in a bad life. <clears throat> but it's just like when you over a person that you have a child with and you move on and you bopping your shit, you on the way to a million dollars and you got women that look like rip the runway throwing that puss at you. Excuse my language. <laughs> It's like they go to is you're measurable, you're measurable. Don't entertain that shh. Don't scratch yourself. Right? It's like it's motives behind it. Unnecessary pettiness. Don't get into it. Don't put your life in jeopardy. Don't put your freedom. <laughs> Baby's kids. Shut up my nigga baby. But uh don't put your freedom in jeopardy. Don't stress yourself. I don't even think about it. If your child is at VP, if your child is at school, <laughs> or neither one of you have your child, she put their ass on the block list for about 10, 15 minutes so they can stop yapping at You know what I'm saying? Because MFers think they know you and they don't know you for real. When you be geared a certain way. Oh, you're 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 going, you're doing that, you're doing. That's me. I don't indulge in drugs. I take no drugs. I don't even drink energy drinks. I don't drink coffee. I'm sober. I used to take ecstasy. I don't have my I don't have my past. Shit, everybody now used to like the jig. I used to, a lot of women fuck with me, so shit. I used to like to hang out sometimes, but this is me. This has always been my personality. I don't need drugs to do me. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like my sober mindset. If I got to tend to some business, I'm going to be sober, dog. I don't need no influence to do how I'm geared. You feel me? So it's just like, do let me out. You know what I'm saying? It's just like when it get... Trill and T, rest in peace, Sweet Jones. That that tone change, and it's just like, don't put yourself in jeopardy behind BS, man. Move on with your life. Find you a solid woman, or find you a solid husband. You know what I'm saying? Whatever the case may be. You know what I'm saying? Find you something solid. If you find true love, be happy, live your life. Don't let a person in misery try to make you be in misery because they miserable, and sit on the couch and eat chips and drink coca-colas and just want to be petty i'm just saying I'm, I'm speaking in general i'm just speaking in general this can be your situation my situation anybody's situation you know but i just want people to stop stressing out because i don't believe in domestic violence but it's just like some things you can't come back from and self-restraint is the best thing to have i've never hit a female a day in my life i've never so much as mushed a woman in the face I don't believe in that. My my uncle is Kenny Powers. I know how to fight. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not going to never touch a female. I, I love women. I appreciate women. I don't think it's too many men knowing better than me. You hear me? But um, it's just like, don't put yourself in jeopardy at all. Don't put your, your freedom in jeopardy, bro. Don't stress yourself out because stress kills. And you will go bald-headed stressing about somebody you don't give two about. So live your life, bro. Live your life, man. Spread your wings. Inspire people. Do what you do best. Go to your job. You know what I'm saying? Take care of your kids. Because the only ties you have is your children or a child. So let it be just that. It should be no other conversation. It should be nothing. Unless you you trying to patch things up or you trying to get with that person. It should be no other conversation. If you're a good father or you're a good mother, you shouldn't go through no heat. You shouldn't go through no grief. 
salute to the real fans out there. You shouldn't have to go through no bullshit. Like, you taking care of your business? And you still feeling that heat? That is just dumb. And it's just like, you have to grip your mind and just come to the realization. It's just like, what are we doing? I don't give a, a shoe. You can go marry Steve Urkel tomorrow. It, you know what I'm saying? It'll, it'll make me, shh, I'll be happy in the mud. You know what I'm saying? Because I ain't got to worry about all that extra. Hopefully you take up enough of your time so you'll stop taking up mine. You feel me? Grip your mind. Stay focused. Don't let them discourage you. Don't let them talk crazy to you. Dog, go for what you know. You know what I'm saying? You work a nine to five. You at a Fortune 500 company. Don't be at work thinking about the book. They say it. Because your job is to be a parent to your child. And that's your only job. Not to take care of her. Not to take care of him. Whatever the situation may be. I'm, I'm speaking in general. Male and female. Whatever your case is. If you shots out to the LGBT. You know what I'm saying? Whatever your case is. You know what I'm saying? Just, just don't be on that, bro. Because you're you going to cause yourself a lot of pain and heartache. And you can get yourself in trouble for no reason. Because a person that's nine times out of ten ain't about that. They talking. They doing a whole lot of barking. And then you got, you know what I'm saying, sidebars. You know what I'm saying? And you handling your business. So I don't understand why anybody will intervene with what you got going on. Why would anybody step up and, oh... I feel so sorry for you. Get the all that victim. You better open up your eyes, bro. Don't fire a lot behind something you don't give two about. I know better.